there is a story about a woman a rural woman an illiterate woman who did not know how to read hmm so she was in her village and her lover was a soldier serving in some far off land and he would write her letters and the woman had no way of reading those letters huh? she was illiterate the only way she could have read them was by using somebody else's services but because the letters were from her lover intimate letters she didn't want somebody else to read them so when the letters would arrive she would not even open the envelope she would kiss the letters keep the letters close to her heart and carry them everywhere she would go if she is traveling there would be a small case containing those letters hmm eating the letters are next to her sleeping the letters are by her side and then one day one of her close friends visited her she knew how to read and because she was a close friend this woman could trust her to read those letters one by one she read out those letters this woman heard those letters she cried in joy tears were rolling down her cheeks and having heard the content of the letters she came to a point where she didn't feel the need to carry them all the time with her earlier the letters used to be an unspoken promise a promise unheard of something waiting to happen and she would be very very attached to them hmm now the contents of the letters are revealed and she could keep the letters in some place safe the urge to carry them reduced but still she had stocked them she would look at them they meant a lot to her then one day her lover returned and together they decided to go and visit places travel tour enjoy and when these two had gone out she discovered that she had forgotten to carry the letters and neither did she feel bad nor guilty
attachment is just a promise attachment is lack of fulfillment attachment is a substitute of love because the real thing is not available so i'm holding on to an alternative it is like those letters and the more distant the real thing is the more is the attachment till the time she had not read the letters she would not even keep them away when she had read the letters she could at least keep them away and after the lover came home she could even forget the letters there was no need to be attached because now love is there when love is there why be attached why be attached a fake thing never really can be a substitute for the real thing that is the bad news the good news is attachment even if it is fake at least tells us of an urge to get the real thing so it is a good piece of news if you find yourself attached it means there is a desire for love it means there is a call for love now it depends on you you can either get stuck at attachment you can either get stuck with the letters or you can move ahead to the lover are you getting it when the lover is there attachment is not possible attachment is there only when lover and love are absent you know what attachment says if i keep the letter away then something might be lost so let me keep this thing close to my heart let me remain attached to it there is a threat there is a fear love says i have already had all that could be had there is no reason to stick to something there is no reason to get fixated there is no need to be thinking about somebody there is no need to be physically close to somebody all the time and that brings us to another point what are we attached to are we ever are we ever attached to the real thing you say you are attached to an idea or you are attached to a gadget or a car or you are attached to a person a family member a friend hmm when you say you are attached to something is it not always the physical the material the bodily that you are attached to is the attachment not always with the exterior or can you ever be attached to the essence and if i am attached to somebody's physical presence then can i ever go beyond his physical presence would love really be possible think of this the lover comes home and the woman is still attached to the letters and is ignoring the lover
if she is still attached to the letters would she listen to what now he is saying directly in front of her she is attached to her words she is attached to the past and the lover is right in front of her attachment is always to an object always and as long as you are dealing with objects you cannot have love you will only have attachment in fact love is so very objective that it does not even require a living being attachment is something that is possible even with materials not that a conscious entity is getting attached to a material even a material can get attached to another material if i leave these materials on this table for a time long enough they'll get attached you know of molecular diffusion don't you just as gases mix with each other similarly solids also mix with each other albeit at a very slow rate they'll get attached body meets body physical meets physical material meets material and they are attached it is such a dead thing attachment it has nothing of the present in it all it requires is time past and future it does not care for the present give it long enough time and attachment will happen and love has nothing to do with past or future it is not in memories when you are with your lover are you thinking of what happened 2 years back if you are really with him are you dealing with him or his image so in love there is a timelessness in attachment there is only time and time memories and a wait and a wait and a wait that something real will happen which is good we said because in attachment you realize that you are waiting for something real to happen it's just that attachment tells you that the real will happen in the future so let me keep waiting you say let me remain attached by remaining attached maybe one day love will happen it's not possible by remaining attached to the envelope will you meet the lover one day is it possible by remaining attached to the envelope will you get to read the letter one day is it possible it will not happen but attachment makes a false promise it says stay with this man and maybe one day the climax of love will materialize it will not just by staying with something over a period of time no movement happens no depth comes in the relationship that is why you see people remaining together for years and years and yet there is no depth in their relationship because the relationship is just body to body thought to thought image to image this relationship can be very easily shaken hmm there is so much of confusion doubt and suspicion in such relationships one small shake up and the relationship collapses have you not seen such things and those people have been together since a long time 
living together being together just gives you attachment and yes if you are together with something attachment will surely happen if you have been riding a bike since 2 years you will get attached to it does that not happen have you seen that you might be living in a hostel room but when you have to vacate it you look at it wistfully oh my god i am vacating it and you knew you always knew it was a hostel room but just because you have stayed in it for one year a little bit of attachment happened did it not and when you come back to the hostel after passing out as an alumnus you go back to that room and you say you know i used to live here you are still attached does that not happen and you call that your fond memories so attachment is just time if you have spent time with anything it gets imprinted in the memory and that is attachment and we are saying that attachment presents itself as a substitute for real relationship which is bad and attachment is an indicator that you are waiting for the real relationship that is good so if you get easily attached then realize that you are waiting for something more real more promising more fulfilling have you seen people who get very easily attached they would spend 2 hours with a co passenger in the train and while exiting the train they'll want to take all the details and say you know it was great spending time with you and this and that and some of them might even start crying i don't know if there is such a man he needs love attachment will not help him but love is demanding love is only for those who value freedom love is only for those who value truth love is not for those who make cheap compromises by just remaining attached so i'm repeating one last time if you find yourself getting attached know that a fake is presenting itself as a substitute for the real and also it is good news because now you know what you are waiting for so you cannot be misled hmm waiting for the real thing.